And so I do my early walkthrough of Dundestan. Just give you a bearing of where we are, the basketball court. Uh, Cherry so there. Old Eston Sawyer, remember Eston Sawyer. Uh, so I come down through the understand doing my walkabout. Boy, I miss old Dini. When I look on the side here, the Surfside Club used to be a, the talk of the town. A bustling metropolis that's turned into a, a garden of casuarina trees. Wow. And on the left side here is the Cornish. Lewis Cornish. But I remember Uncle Lou. Remember um, Big Soup? Boy, it's hard to see Big Soup gone. He was such an inspiration to Kai Mills. I mean, his beautiful wife, but Big Soup was left the building. And I used to see Big Soup right in Danny Kitchen. That's where you get the name from, Big Soup. He used to tell Danny, put it all in one bucket. They all go in the same place. So it might as well start in the same place. But this is Dundestown. As I walk down memory lane on the 1st of December 2022. Danny is gone. Big Soup was gone. Kai almost was gone. But I'm still here. But man, every time I stop and look at the surf side club and to see this bunch of rubble that should have been gone if Kai Mills was in charge of the hurricane. How could you uh, leave all this stuff and you have millions and millions of dollars to collect all this stuff and they leave it right there because they don't care. If nobody is paying attention, they do what they want to do, collect that money. That's the traffic. Um, ever since the hurricane, everybody's gone crazy with these traffic. You got to watch yourself. You can't walk no more and done this time without being on your P's and Q. Hey, Bottle. Hey! You gotta be uh, on your P's and Q and done this time. That's my Uncle David back there somewhere. He got more trees than Jungle Gym. I said, do a video. Of my passes through Dundestan, the first of December. There is the famous car wash, TT car wash. Um, that mango tree right there. I don't like how they take that mango tree and put them over here. But this all used to be a beautiful place to grow up right along here. Somebody got some idea to clean the property. Clean the property, but that's as far as they get. As I do my walkthrough. And I try not to put the fellas on video, but I walking through the understand and everybody passing me these young fellas and I don't know who nobody is. Well that's a strange thing when you grow up in this town and you don't know anybody. Back here boy used to get all kind of sugar apple. Uh, you know, the sound is a strange place. You see all this carpet right across here from where Mother Merge used to be. You had canep trees. Uh, you have peach mango trees. You had bull mango tree. The only thing survived was that bull mango tree right there. You have sopadilly tree. That's a sopadilly tree that is being killed by the hop vine. You had every tree you could imagine on somebody else's property. And you ask yourself, how many homes in Dundestan has an edible tree on it? Very few, because they weren't brought up right. I was brought up with parents that made sure that you had, and what we need is more trees that you could go in the backyard and feed yourself. We have some of the most fertile land in the Caribbean. Uh, but people don't see that. Every tree, they used to come here. Like they own this, that's where they practicing stealing as a youth. You're going on this man's property, 
picking your bags of canep, your bags of mangoes, your dilly, uh, your sugar hopper, all in this man tree for years, and you ain't had the gumption to go and plant a seed all your life, you're stealing off the man property. And right over here, boy, this road right here. Mother Mother is how more customers come to the back door and the front door. All I can see is bags and bags coming through the back door. Let me take it through a pilgrimage. All the people from my shop, the white folks, they're in dining. They're getting theirs to go, so they will come right here for decades, over four decades, five decades. Come right up here. And before they get ready for their pilgrimage, they'll have right under this sapodilly tree that's trying to catch itself after the hurricane. Yank, Shirley, and Mother Mud, the three musketeers, they will be under that tree taking a break, taking a break before they get into the kitchen. You see, I was like family, so I come to the back door and go to the front door. This will be the kitchen. Mother Mud walking around with them little legs, and them little bony legs. And boy, this place has made so many people happy for over five decades. Mother Merle's fishnet. And Mother Merle's proved something that she was the only black businesswoman that understand if you had a good product, don't care where you were, they would come to you because you have a good product. I saw that with the... Uh, Murray South House in Nassau. All over Nassau, they come for the same food. That's Mother Merle's. All over the world. When they come here, when they get at the Great Abaco Beach Hotel, a household name was Mother Merle's. I could see Nubby. This is Nubby Bar right there. Nubby would be at the bar. Boy, that's a, that's a soul I missed. That was a strong block to understand, brother. That's Nubby, then that's where the deli used to be. Jermaine come and open the little deli right there, all that is gone. Man, that hurricane, Dorian was a game changer. All this right here. You know how many, how many thousands of people, thousands and thousands of people came up and walked on those steps. I was so proud to be a Dundestanian when I would walk into Mother Merle's and she always, you know, the older people always love Kai. These young brutes, they ain't nothing but love. Mother Merle's would love me. Man, I bring tourists. I bring tourists. Bring tourists. Bring tourists because I know that I can get a good tip because they get good food and once they're gone eat, that's a good thing. But Nubby... Mother Merle's, Angela, may they soul rest in peace. They were a staple of good, professional business people. When everybody in Dundas and Murphy Town felt that in order to make money, you have a, to have a business in Marshaba. Mother Merle said, no, they want what I got. And only I have it. Mother Merle's fish nut, that piece and rice, that fried poke chop, that fish, that conch. You can eat the conch with your gum. That's so tender. Mother Merle's conch was. Man, I, I can stop talking because I may be able. I, I may get tear up. All that good memories was in one place here. Mother Merle's fishnet right here in Dundestan. Boy, have I missed them. Good people. Good, good, decent people. These hateful people, Hurricane can't do nothing with them. <laughs> As I conclude this video this morning of the best place in Dundestan. This was the talk of the town. Right here, Mother Merle's.
May she continue to rest in peace. Hanabi and Angela Kai Case on the first day of December 2022. I'm walking you down memory lane in Thunderstone. This is what you got, baby. If these cars will knock you, up, knock you down, you gotta watch how you walk in Thunderstone now because they don't care. They don't care. Kai cares. That's why he's here.